can't reach it, Sally. Jump higher, Nick! Higher! <laughs> we'll never reach our balloon, Sally. Mind if I jump in? It's the cat! The cat of the hat! It's your lucky day. I happen to know a lot about jumping. You do? Oh, yes. I'm on my way to jump a LaRue right now to give this prize to the world's best jumper. <laughs> Maybe the best jumper in the world can teach us to jump higher so we could get our balloon back. Then why don't you come too? Your mother will not mind at all if you do. Mom, can we go to jump a LaRue to learn to jump higher? Jump a LaRue? <laughs> okay, you jump right along and have fun. We can go, we can go! I know, I know! To the thingamajigger! <laughs> Away we go! <laughs> to jump a LaRue! You know, fish are great jumpers. <laughs> Ta-da! They always make a big splash. <laughs> Buckle up! <laughs> Flick the Jigger my wizard <laughs> Isn't this fun? <laughs> Here we go, 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 go On an adventure, the thing of my Jigger is up and away How to jump up real high. We'll jump and we'll jump till we reach the sky. Here we go, 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 go. On an adventure. Go, 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 go. Welcome to Jumbleroo. Hold on to your socks. This joint is jumping. Why, Jumbleroo isn't jumping at all. <laughs> What? Not jumping. It's the jumpiest place around. Okay, okay. You don't need to jump up and down about it. Nice to meet you. Why, a pleasure, I'm pretty sure. We're looking for the best jumper in the world to help us jump higher. You've come to the right place. Jumping's a great thing to do. I love it. Jump, jump, jump. We can't jump as high as a kangaroo. When you want to jump high like a gray kangaroo. Who better to help than thing one and thing two? Hey, guys! What are those? They're go-go jumpers. They'll give you the extra bounce you need. Set to kangaroo. As high as can be. Jump, 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 just like me. <laughs> jump, 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 as high as can be. Jump, 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 hee, hee, hee. <laughs> Maybe I should give myself the prize for best jumper. <laughs> Maybe not. Oh, you guys are great jumpers. How do you jump so high? It must be those feet. Whoa, you must wear size 111 shoes. <laughs> My big feet help push me up. And strong legs and a long tail for balance. And you've got... The best jumper in Jumpaloo. <laughs> I was going to say a pretty good jumper, but not the best. Who jumps better than you? The jumping twins, Gary and Barry. Are they kangaroos too? No. Take a look for yourself, guys. They're jumping this way. Woo! 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 Woo!
Gary and Barry are grasshoppers. They're better jumpers than kangaroos. Oh, we have to meet them. To the thingamajigger. Aren't we too big to talk to grasshoppers? Yes, pass that shrink a doodle uh, I had to ask. I can jump higher than you. No, I can jump higher than you. No, I can because I have stronger legs than you do. No, I have stronger legs than you do. Wow, grasshoppers are better jumpers than kangaroos. They're going way up in the air. Excuse me. May we have a word? Sure can. I'm Gary. And I'm Barry. We're looking for the best jumper in Jumpalaroo. That's me. No, it's me. Why don't you both jump together and we'll see who jumps highest. Okay. Woohoo! <laughs> Who's jumping highest? They're jumping so high, I can't tell. I've got what you need. Go, go, jumpers! Hold on, hold on. Those go-go jumpers are still set for kangaroo jumps. If you want to jump as high as Gary and Barry, dial them up to Grasshopper. Whee! Now you're jumping! I'm higher than you! No, I'm higher than you! You're both the best jumpers in Jumpalaroo! Who jumped higher? Yeah, yeah, who jumped higher? Barry. Or, oh, no, well, Gary. I don't, I, you know, I can't pick. <laughs> You're both so good. Well, I know who the best jumper is. Yeah, me. No, not you. Fred. Oh, yeah, Fred. I guess he is a little better. Who's Fred? You know Fred. Fred the flea. You'll find Fred on a bird or a dog or maybe that dingo over there. Thanks, Barry. Uh, Gary. Sorry to buzz on and out. We're looking for Fred the Flea. Have you seen him? Oh, 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 yes. He's on my back. Could you ask him to hop onto someone else? He's making me itchy. <laughs> we'll ask him for you, Mr. Dingo. Let's go. Wait. We need to go even smaller to find the best jumper. If we get any smaller, we're going to disappear. Press the shrink of a noodle. Again. <laughs> Wow, we're so small that the dingo's hair looks like trees. How will we find Fred? Don't worry, he'll find us. Whoopee! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, visitors, I love meeting you people. <laughs> well, we're very happy to meet you. Do you know anything about jumping? Jumping? I love to jump! Whoopee! Barry and Gary were right. Fred can jump much higher than a grasshopper. Whoopee! Jumping onto passers-by lets me get around piggyback style. It helps to have super springy legs, but you still have to jump right. Can you show us how? Can I? Sure! First, I curl up like a ball. Then I push with my legs and spring up with everything I've got. Whoopee! Curl, push, spring! That's my best jump ever! I want to jump like a flea, too! <laughs> jump, 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 as high as can be! Jump, 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 just like a flea! Jump, 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 as high as can be! Jump, 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 just like a flea! <laughs> We're sure to reach our balloon if we jump like Fred! Whoa! Nothing jumps better than a flea. Whoa! And nothing scratches an itch better than a dingo. Time for me to hop off. Bye, Fred. Bye, Bye. Bye. Thanks for teaching us how to jump. Time for us to hop to it, too. To the thingamajigger. <gasps> we forgot to give Fred his medal. That's okay. I have an idea, so it won't go to waste. We had a great time in Jumpalaroo with grasshoppers, flea, and a gray kangaroo. E 
Each one's a great jumper who can jump really high. We picked up some tips. Now let's give them a try. Okay, Sally, think like a kangaroo. With your big feet ready to push up. And with all the strength in my strong grasshopper legs. Now curl up like a flea and... Jump! Whoa! I did it! I jumped really high! Great jump, Sally. So we won't lose it again. I wish Fred was here to see. Yeah, I wonder where we hop to. I think I know. Oh, on me! Oh, so much back! Hi, everybody. I've got a doozy of a question about giraffes. Ooh. How does a giraffe clean its nose? With its tongue? That's right. A giraffe's tongue is so long it can stick it inside its own nose. How did you know that? You got it this time, but next time I'll stump you for sure. Sally. We'll never know how to color in the butterfly wings if we can't see it up close. Hmm. I'll get close to him this time. <sighs> <sighs> no, it's no good. We're way too slow. Too slow? It's the cat. The cat in the hat. You're not too slow. You're too fast. Too fast? If you move fast, you'll scare it away. You need to be really, really slow to get near a butterfly. Wow. You did it, cat. <laughs> ah, two. Oh. Going slow is really hard to do. Oh, it is. But I do know a slowpoke who might show you how. Really? You do? A sloth called unslow. A sloth? What's a sloth? A sloth is a creature who's slower than slow. He lives in the forest of Gogo Largo. Can we go go visit him? Yeah! Your mother will not mind at all if you do. Mom, can we visit Gogo Largo and learn how to go slow? Go slow? That'll be the first time you guys have ever been slow. <laughs> sure, go ahead. We can go! We can go! I know, I know! To the thingamajigger! What's the big hurry? We want to learn how to go slow. You're going fast so you can go slow? That's right, fish. Are you ready? Yes, we are. Are you steady? Yes, we are. Are you sure you're ready to explore? Yes, we are. Then buckle up. <laughs> Flick the jigger, my wizard. <laughs> Here we go, 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 go! On an adventure, the thing of my jigger is up and away! Go, 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 go! On an adventure, we're flying with the cat in a hat today! We're off to the forest of Gogo Largo to visit a slop and learn to go slow! Here we go, 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 go! On an adventure, go, 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 go! But where's Onslow? Let me check his address. Hmm, 
Seven hundred and forty-six tree from the left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven hundred and forty-six. This is his tree. I don't see anything. Except for that green ball. Green ball, you say? That's not a green ball. Take a look. Is that Onslow? It is. Cool. He's all green. Can I see? Um, where is he? The green covering his fur makes him hard to see amongst all those leaves. Oh, I see him now. But he's not green. There's green stuff sticking to his brown fur. That would be algae. Algae? Algae is green stuff that grows on trees and rocks. Onslow is so slow, it even grows on him. Cool. Hey, Onslow. Hello, Onslow. Look, Sally, another butterfly. Let's draw that one instead. Good idea. <laughs> hey, don't fly around. <laughs> we just want to see your wings. <laughs> Slow down. You're going too fast. Onslow! Sorry we woke you up, my friend. How's it going? Slow. Hey there, little feller. Hey, there goes our butterfly. <laughs> he sat on your head, Onslow. Yep. That's because I moved so slow, he didn't get startled. Wow! Can you show us how to do that? We want to be slow like you. Wait there and I'll climb down. <sighs> Isn't he down yet? <sighs> well... <laughs> Why don't we meet Onslow halfway, huh? We'll have more time to hang out together. When you said hang out, you really meant it. <laughs> Onslow, why do you move so slowly? Well, if I move slowly, then I don't need to eat so much. Do you just eat leaves? Every meal. We want to move slowly to get close to butterflies. That'll work. How about you guys have a race? But racing is fast. I think he means a slow race. Yep, Cat's got it right. <sighs> Remember, this is a slow race. Last one to cross the finish line is the winner. On your marks, get set. Go slow. <laughs> And they're off. Nick takes an early lead, but Sally is going nowhere fast. You can't catch me. I'm trying not to, remember? Oh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, this race might be the slowest race ever. Out of the way, slow pokes. You're holding up traffic. Hiya, Speedy. How's it going on, slow? Slow as usual. What a race! You've got to be going slow for tortoises passing you. <laughs> I won a race? Wow! Sorry, Speedy, but you came in last. I did? Nick and Sally were way slower than you. Slowest wins. Way to go! Slow! Look! The butterfly! Now's our chance to get a closer look. Remember... Go slow, or you'll scare it away. <gasps> <sighs> Nearly there, but you need to go even slower. <gasps> I have an idea. Wait right there. Oh, this is going to take forever. Waiting for a sloth with nothing to do? Why not whistle for things one and two? <whistles> <Ow>! <whistles> <laughs> they can't help, Cat. The things do nothing slow. Not so fast. <laughs> These ancient exercises are guaranteed to slow anyone down. That's my kind of workout. Can we try? <laughs> it's working! <laughs> hey, come back! Oh no, we'll never move.
move slow enough to see a butterfly wing. Here I am. Thanks for waiting. They say good things come to those who wait. And sloths are definitely good things. When your world gets too fast, there's a trick all sloths know. Slow down, don't be speedy, just go with the flow. When you slow things right down, the world comes to you. It's really quite easy, just do as I do. I can go slow, how slow can you go? I can go slow, how slow can you go? I can go slow, how slow can you go? I can go slow. How slow can you go? I can go slow. I can go slow. Slow, slow, slow. Onslow's fast asleep. He's been very busy for a sloth. Bye, Onslow. Bye. Bye. We had quite an adventure in Gogo Largo, where Onslow the Sloth showed us how to go slow. Just being with him has slowed us right down. For the king of the slow pokes, a sloth takes the crown. What took you so long? You can't hurry when you're going slow. <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure this will work? Remember what Onslow said, slow down. And the world comes to you. Hello, little butterfly. Can we look at your wings? Wow! Beautiful! It's the best butterfly drawing I ever saw. Anso is right. By slowing down, we did get close enough to see its beautiful wings. How about another slow race? Sure. I can slow race all day. Come on, cat. No, thanks. I think I'll be like Onslow and hang for a while. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, how sweet to be a sloth. <sighs> Welcome to Hat Chat. Today we're interviewing our friend, the Canada Goose. Welcome, Canada Goose. I really love your nice long black neck. Thank you. That's how you can tell I'm a Canada Goose, eh? Does that mean you only live in Canada? Oh, no. We live all over North America. In summer, most of us stay in Canada. But in winter, most of us fly south, where it's warmer and we can find food easier. Why do you fly in that really cool V shape? It's easier to fly if someone else gets the air moving in front of you. But isn't it hard to hear each other up there? It is! That's why we have such a nice, loud honk! I can see you're eager to get back on your trip. Thanks for the interview! That's a wrap with our friend, the Canada Goose. You're welcome. Bye there! See you in spring! The busy bee flies fast and low. Flower to flower, watch her go. Landing on the plants below. She helps to make the flowers grow. And everywhere she lands, buzzing to and fro. The busy bee is moving, spreading pollen as she goes. Everywhere she lands, buzzing to and fro. The busy bee is helping all the plants and flowers grow. In the flower's center, there is a little wick. The pollen coats the surface, it's fluffy and it's thick. When the bee gets closer, its body makes it stick. When it moves from plant to plant, oh, that's what does the trick. And everywhere she lands, buzzing to and fro, the busy bee is moving, spreading pollen as she goes. The busy bee is helping all the plants and flowers grow. A rainforest's quite a magical space where so many animals live in one place. So let us look closely at one single tree. And 
You'll be amazed at all you will see. At the top of the tree, there are bugs, birds, and bats. Things that have wings, but no ties and no hats. A rainforest is a great place to rest. And often a bird will build a big nest. Down here in the middle, where the branches are thick, we'll see howler monkeys. That is, if we're quick. Here, they find fruit and leaves that they eat. And even some bugs that they'll munch for a treat. A tortoise likes to stay near the ground. And an anteater licks up the ants he has found. And now, my friends, I hope you've understood. This is not just a tree. It's a whole neighborhood. Hi, kids. Do you know what kind of sound an owl makes? <laughs> Who? Well, the owl, of course. You know, the bird with the really big eyes? <laughs> anyway, what sound does an owl make? <laughs> That's right! An owl says, Hoo! You got it this time, but next time I'll stump you for sure. Hoo. Me, that's who!